welcomed Trevor Phillips, the Chair of the Commission for Equality and Human Rights, to meet people in the Old Trafford community this afternoon. I wanted Trevor to come and hear people talk about what's been successful in Old Trafford, how the different communities have really worked well together, live well together, support one another, and what the community feels like, what it's like to be part of Old Trafford. I think one thing I could say, obviously it's interesting seeing Trevor um, come down into your local area, um, having knowledge working at the Commission and what we promote in terms of equal opportunity, to actually get somebody who's in such a high position to spend time in a local area is very valuable and for me working there it's kind of even made me feel um, much more valuable not only as a resident but as an employee to see somebody represent the Commission in such a way and take time out to come into such a small local community so for me that was very very valuable. It was great, it was great to be involved in my first community activity and I want to get involved more as a local resident. Um, it's great to see people that I recognised um, just from around and about and at the shops. Get, you know, obviously I've lived here for years and that I've got loads to say about living here, the things that I just didn't know about at all. And obviously it's really good to see the MP um, and local councillors to actually have a conversation with them. We can do things in Old Trafford that ought to be possible at least to learn from for other communities, even if they're not quite the same. But the successes that it's possible to replicate or the mimicking of successes that we have had in Old Trafford, I think is something Trevor was really interested in. In terms of having a community, is everybody is a family within the community. So if you've got that strength that people are working together, um, you can develop your community bonding and they can support each other greater. So it's essentially it's one of the key things to have community spirit and community strength. We talk a lot about problems locally and, it's, and I think you're right, Old Trafford is a very unique place. We, the reason we wanted to move to Old Trafford is because it's a very multicultural, multi-ethnic area. Um, it's loads of people are saying, oh, it's, it's a great place to live, it's got a real community vibe, there's loads of things that you can get involved in. As one of the participants said, this is a community of migrants. And so perhaps people in Old Trafford are more used to seeing newcomers and adapting to newcomers and welcoming them in and how you might be able to replicate that in other communities where there's less migration and where communities are much more stable and settled and it's harder for newcomers to settle. We can live, regardless what we've got, what we haven't got, we, still we can still live in harmony and we still get on to do things and it's only because of what they call the big society now, isn't it? That's what we are. We do things for ourselves, we help one another. I think it was a really good event. Um, I think we need more now of these sort of community engagement events. Events. I think not just to be consulted with, to be actively involved in making decisions and I, I mean it's the first one I've been to but I'm definitely going to get involved now as a local resident. Afterwards I felt it had gone really well. I thought loads of people had had something to say and Trevor had spoken to them but he'd listened to them too. I want to do more of them, not just always with Trevor Phillips. Um, I think you know sometimes we can just do them within our communities, sometimes we could perhaps invite other public figures to come along and meet Old Trafford because I think Old Trafford's pretty special um, and it was a good chance for it to show off and to talk about the positive side of what goes on in this community uh, and I think that made for a really great afternoon. I'm <laughs> just